Yeah, I hit start and then changed the stuff. Quite foolish. A common mistake. One I still make after all these years. For as long as I can remember, my family ran what we called a horror caravan. We hauled this house of horrors around from town to town, trying to give people a new thrill, a new nightmare. I kind of like traveling, but all that gruesome gore got to me after a while. <laughs> My dad was always conjuring up new devices, tricks, and traps, each one scarier than the last. <laughs> Guess who he tried them out on? Yep, me. No! No! I guess it toughened me up a little. I mean, you have to be brave to walk through a den of snakes or try to avoid trap doors to make it to your room. I was a pretty fearless kid by the time I was five, thanks to my fearsome father. He fed on others' fears and was never satisfied. My mom couldn't stand how obsessed he'd gotten, so she thankfully divorced him when I was six. Yet I had gotten attached to horror. I remember how that good old Halloween pillow and a hot red water bath soothed me. I think I might major in child psychology. So, how'd I do? That was great! I mean, you're the head of the Horror Research Club and... President of the Student Council! The Horror it's Research Club. You win this speech contest for sure. Hey, everybody! You gotta see this! What, Michelle? Why didn't you listen to Erico's speech? I don't need to. I know she'll win. Here, take a look at this. Those are guest invitations to Ilbley. How'd you get him? From a Pepco promotion. Cool! Look, we can win a hundred million bucks there! Yeah, if we can manage to get through the whole park, that is. No sweat! I'm game if you are! Sure thing! I'm with ya! <laughs> what about you, Erico? His little happy dance. I think I'll pass. It sounds too good to be true. Why? You just said in your speech to conquer your fear and surpass the odds. Come on, we can test your theory. Sounds like we're trying to be superheroes or something. It's no biggie. It's just a house of horrors. Probably full of cheesy props and gags. Which proves what's so weird about this. How can a funky place like that afford a hundred million dollar reward? Who knows? Maybe they'll make it take so long to get through it, everyone will give up, go home, and the horror honchos will end up with a lot of free publicity. Or else the whole thing is a hoax, and they don't have the money at all. I agree with him. I'm down with that. I'm not voting. Or going. For real? Are you positive? You sure? Yep, you heard me. Okay, your highness. Then we three humble slaves shall bring back the 100 million dollars and you'll be sorry. I can't wait to commune with the undead. I'd use the money for a chainsaw and hack my way into fame and fear. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, brother. Okay then. We'll catch you later, Erico. Let's, Let's go! go! Whoosh. 
few days later. <laughs> Excuse me, did you see three high school kids around here three days ago? They had special invites. <coughs> what? <coughs> Spelled cemetery wrong. Dump you right in. Wonderful. There's like one decent camera, and I'm trying to remember which one it is. This one's way too close. I think it's the other auto kit. Yeah, this one. Tell me to come here. The home run of death. So you can just fucking hop right in, right? come true. Neither did Jimmy or his father, Gail Banbalo, a Minnesota innkeeper. He set up a secret baseball practice arena in the basement of his inn, where he and his son practiced day after day. Jimmy's hard work and batting skills finally led his team to a state victory. It started out a crisp spring day, but before Jimmy could go outside to play, he and his dad went downstairs to bat the ball around a few times. Upstairs, some teenagers had been playing with fire, turning the inn into a raging blaze that was soon out of control. The inn was a total loss, and so was Jimmy, burned in minutes. Mr. Banbala was so badly maimed, he turned into a hideous monster, oozing and bleeding, snarling and growling like a beast, enraged and bent on revenge. He tracked down the kids responsible for the fire and killed them one by one with a blowtorch. That wasn't enough for Banbalo. He won't leave his inn or his memories, so there he waits, in ambush. God, I love this format so much. Just the combi anger of Bambala. His only weakness is Jimmy. But he is mad he quickly drops his guard when he thinks of Jimmy. We only 
have on character. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, right? Isn't that badass? What is the dodge button supposed to be? Oh, it's only during combat. Okay. Cool. I think this... So, I believe this first trap is unavoidable. Like, they make it so it doesn't do damage or anything. We're looking for... I forget where it is. We're looking for the sense goggles. Oh, here it is. Horror... the whore monitor. We're gonna go monitor some whores. I think there's more stuff, but I think there's one right in front of the house. It's right here. That costs some adrenaline. Cool. Cool. So we predicted it, so... We don't get the ill effects of falling down into a hole, losing health, and whatever else. Ah, oh, fuck. There, see, we lost a little health. We have a little bit higher bleeding threshold. Nothing? Deep breath. That is, I think, a stress, a stress healing item or something. Hi, pickles. What does she see? This is ill bleed. This game kicks ass. Ah, oh, boo. Oh, fuck! Dude, I'm getting owned. Oh my god, really? Kinda getting shit on here. Dude, I suck. I'm so bad. I refuse to leave without one more. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. Oh, okay, it's a Hassy. Hassy, I think, is a health item? Most popular stamina drink, slight recovery of stamina, and greens kept secret. Deep breath, relaxes pulse by inhaling through nose and exhaling through mouth. That's right. The heart rate limit for shock death. Uh, it's like 200. For, I think it's for like, it's not instantaneous, I don't think.
Yeah, it might be even higher. Or zero, yeah. You can have a low heart rate. That's what the erotic magazines are for. safe for a little bit. Aha! Cool. Cool. He's paper clipping one. Youngsters can join us. Chateau Banball opens today. Youth Hostel Chateau Banball open today. A place where the young can gather. Owner Mr. Banball says with enthusiasm, I want the chateau to be a utopia for teenagers. The hostel, an excellent leisure facility surrounded by nature, is an excellent leisure facility. <laughs> Listen, the writing is not, you know, it's not the Grapes of Wrath. Oh, I am super fucking low on adrenaline. So you can't just, like, tag everything. Because it costs to tag things, and if you don't successfully, like, call out the thing that you were tagging, then you don't get that, that currency back. Alright, fire at Chateau Banball who claims the life of owner and son. Fire broke out last night in the annex of Chateau Banball. Jimmy Eight, son of Mr. Banball of 41, died of severe burns. The proper use of fireworks by the guests allegedly caused the fire. <laughs> ah, fuck me. Okay, so I gotta be a little carefuler, a little more careful. Uh, see how my... There's that red thing? If I run while I'm bleeding too much, then I believe it takes... It either worsens the bleeding, and I think if you're bleeding bad enough, then it takes your health. I don't know, there's so many meters and shit, it's all very complicated. Heart rate's fine, I think stamina's okay. We've got to take it slow. Damn it. Been watching this game here before. I have streamed it here before. Okay, so smell and sixth sense. So there's something that smells bad nearby, right? I don't know what that could be, though. Oh, thank God. Cool. Dude, there's something around here. Look at my sixth sense going off. Aha! I found a salad. I need adrenaline. Mild recovery of stamina. Hit the Hassy. I need adrenaline really bad. He would never eat a salad, let alone that salad. I'm fucked. I have no adrenaline left. Oh, I have 40. I don't think it, I don't even know if that's enough to use an item. I want to eat a salad you can smell. Yeah, that's uh. Exactly. So there's... I can see something. I think it's like the candle or something like that, you know? Check go... Ugh. Just gonna avoid it. Okay, let's continue. Uh, so there's always stuff in the hallways. Why is my adrenaline going down? Hearing six cents. Smell. Shit. 
Wait, do you get adrenaline back over time? Still zero, now I'm in deep shit. I'm just gonna wing it. Ah! That should get the adrenaline going. I can't even go in here. Yeah, let's just eat shit. I love these animations, they're so good. These little, uh, like attack animations. There's so many of them. Most of them are really funny. Oh, shit. Oh, I don't want to get fucking... Oh, there's gonna be something gross in here. Ooh, what the fuck does that do? I actually don't know. Wait. Oh. Shows on the horror monitor the probability of dying by shock or fainting for the next trap. Okay. Interesting. Adrenaline's still zero. See. That's not gonna save me though. I am in deep shit. <laughs> Still zero. Yeah, right? Uh-oh. Oh. oh. <laughs> Ted fell off. I'm like out of everything, right? Baseball bat. Jimmy, Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy, it's time for practice. Get out to the training field now. Hey, you're not Jimmy. Music is unbelievably good. There's an item somewhere. Ah. 
Aha. Iron Heart. Form Operation ER to strengthen the heart. Resistant to pulse increase. That's for later. We'll just replace our heart with this Iron Heart. Bad. Look over there. Sixth sense is items, so that's fine. But sight, hearing, or smell. Uh, if anything comes up, then we want to avoid whatever that is. It's going to be very hard to recover from. Just game save. Oops. Hey, it's from the last time I played this. Yeah, so you only wanna use your your ghost vision if you're sure. I'm dumb and wasted it all because I wanted to show off how the mechanic works. Oh, perfect. Steak dinner. We'll save that for later. Nitroglycerin. Ooh. I think that's for heart rate. Alexis Pulse fully, yeah. I don't need that quite yet. You know what? I'm gonna actually... Colonel in... Regain adrenaline by using items, defeating enemies, or warning yourself of shock. So... We either need combat, or we need to... I guess it says I can use items, but like I'm just gonna not do that yet because I wanna wait until I can actually use them. Yeah, and if you're stuck with zero adrenaline like I am, then you're just fucked. Alright, let's go run into some traps. Oh, fight time. How do I fight? Oh yeah, here's how you escape fights, which I, I think is fucking wonderful. A rope ladder comes down. Saves your ass. Cannot be used here. How do I... How do I hit things? Yeah, isn't that great? <laughs> they don't, like... They don't really have a whole lot of rules... ...in this game, like, at all. Lee, I thought you could use the bat in combat. Like, you can fight zombies, you can kill them. Like the one we just saw. Ooh, what's this? Oh, fuck yeah, finally. <laughs> Only a hundred. Alright. So we're back in action. I'm gonna... I think now is good heart rate time. It'll help with the bleeding, which will help with my health not going down so quickly. Relaxation CD. So I think it's another recording of wave sounds, dolphins, and windblown trees. Slightly relaxes pulse. See these guys 
Oh, they're kicking my ass. I am totally confused. I want to like mess around with the the fighting sections more. Let's just do it. But, like I'm also very damaged. Okay. Filled with made adrenaline. Mild recovery of adrenaline. Okay. Well, it's fucking nice. Oh, that's a lot, too. A Y button for... R trigger. I didn't get R trigger to do anything for me. But that might be a me problem. There's a lot of shit that could be wrong in here. I thought the baseball bat might have counted as long range. Cool. See, plus 40, I got the adrenaline back. Now, I can smell something bad, so... I'm just gonna take the risk. something in the oven. Aw, oh, steak dinner. Fuck yeah. Cool. There's still something. Damn it. Oh, no fucking way. That was a different spot than the floor spot. That's so rude. Come on, my spider senses are tingling. Sight. Oh, sweet. Actually, my HP is pretty good.
I hate these because it's fucking hard to tell. Like, that could be anything. You got a lot of adrenaline for that. Testimonial. Where did Jimmy when he became an MVP? Memorable item of Banballo. Ooh, that salad did a lot. We have six cents, so there's an item somewhere. Come on. Also sight, though. That's oh, over here somewhere, huh? Paper clipping three. What do we got? Mass homicide at Chateau Banballo. Owner Mr. Banballo mysteriously disappeared. Mercilessly mur- <laughs> The fucking alliteration. Mercilessly murdered bodies were found at Chateau Banballo. Burned. All identified as young guests. Mr. Banballo, the hotel owner, is missing. Details are still under investigation. Diary is found at the site. Hatred directed towards the guests who caused the fire filled the pages. The state police are searching for their suspect, Mr. Banballo, in case you forgot who they were talking about. <laughs> like, the right- everything in this game is so jank. It's so- it's so fun, though. And, like... I'm just gonna play a bunch casually. Like, I'm gonna- I'm gonna finish, of course, but I'm not gonna, like, one-shot it. But, like, the later chapters are also wild. You're telling me I can't see- a single, single risk over here. I flipped over here. Ow. Oh, the Sixth Sense thing was the newspaper clipping. Okay. Shit. I was hoping it'd be, like, a health thing. Sixth Sense. Ooh. Coagulant. That might help. I'm fucking bleeding all over the place. Zero bleeding. Wonderful. That's what we needed. Steps. Gotta keep an eye on the meters. Oh shit. Hopefully it's this. Sweet. Oh yeah, like, as soon as you're, like, entering a room like this, it's like, okay, you gotta, you gotta take some care. There's probably, like, three things in this room at least. Okay, what do we got? One. Six cents. Still nothing. 
Okay, everything's clear. So it's just the one? I find that hard to believe. There, now we're getting a little momentum. Oh, fuck. Ah. Caution bomb. <laughs> okay, I forget what that is. All warning points within 15 meters will be checked by this bomb. Okay, I've never... I don't remember that at all. I should try that. Sindwagon. Syndragon. You got good carts? Well, cool. You hear that? Resin shit? I've been thinking of trying alternative ingesting methods. Something extra fun about smoking, though. Rule of Rose when I could, I would d totally be down to revisit that. I'll, I'll keep that in mind. All right, Eriko, where's the item? I wish we had like a dog. Fuck. If we had a dog, we'd. We'd find the, the thing real quick. Fuck, it stepped on my toes! High school murder game? That sounds like half the games that I play. something. High school murder game. Obscure. Probably not like Man of Medan or Little Hope. Uh, oh, you're right. Obscure. Oh, that game kicks ass. I would absolutely play that again, too. Less ill bleed and more well bleed. Be like the. Ah, oh, there's a smell. <laughs> Fucking A. <laughs> Ew. See, this game's just different than other horror games. So good. It's fucking like honestly, it's creative as shit in a way that other horror games have not not been in a long time. Where it's just so much silly shit all like tossed in here. It's just fucking ridiculous. Yeah. So uh, how about you know the dead body on the ground? I don't trust this door either. Oh, okay. It should give you adrenaline back if you tag an item. Raycon? Oh, Jesus, which one? Cool. I'm fucking paranoid. I have other. Even before BLSC, I have other travel plans that I can't back out of. Like, man. Oh, fucking A. <laughs> oh, ow. Oh, and you just lose time. Time counts towards the money reward at the end. So I lost two minutes. I'm at 36 minutes now. I don't think I've ever beaten this under the money 
Like the, I think it's like a 50 minute timer or something, it's too much. Heart rate, uh... Here, I breathe deep, that should help. Here, we'll listen, and we'll listen to a nice relaxing CD of dolphins and whatever. Are you kidding me? Neither of these? See, if I run, then my bleeding goes up, and if it passes that threshold, then it's permanent. I gotta be careful. More Hassy. That's actually pretty helpful. I might... It's probably a good idea to steak dinner. Injection was 300, I think. Yeah, worth it. Bamballo's Diary 1. Why is it 1? Why is it in separate pages? Hotel business on track. Intensive batting exercise with Jimmy. Batting style seems improved. We'll try a thousand swings. Minnesota Kids League Finals tomorrow. It's in Minnesota. Pop, we'll get up at 4 tomorrow and make a special drink. Do your best, Jimmy. This guy is obsessed. Jimmy hit the winning homer. He's the MVP. Congrats. I can't help shedding my tears of joy. I'll confirm all interests in the restaurant. Guests may ask, Mr. Banball, who's that? Ah, that's Jimmy's. He was chosen MVP in the boys' league. I'll treat the guests with barbecue tonight. Do you think the home run king is this year? It's Jimmy. All because you endured my hard training. You've done well. Your trophy is magnificent. Let's place it in our bedroom so we can see it every day. It's like helicopter parent. Hearing. So it doesn't always specifically correlate, but that means there's a sound spook somewhere. I got the window. Yeah, I know. That's why I was, I was like, okay, a, a sound, a sound jump in, by a TV. Like that seems like it'd be obvious. Oh, an artificial plasma. See, this is just like a like a horror haunted house theme park, but you can get heart surgery and stuff like that. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Hello. Do I want to do two of them? There's only one fight I really hate in this game. I think one or two levels from now. The fucking worms in the supermarket. Oh, I can just run on the beds. That's great. Diary. Banballo's Diary 2. Oh, Jimmy, you are now gone. Papa will treasure your bat. Now I curse the hateful youngsters holding that bat. Bastards. Why did my beloved Jimmy have to be killed by such imbeciles? I will revenge your death. I'll kill all lurking around. I'll do it for you, Jimmy. This guy's very candid in his in his writing. I know there's a staircase over there. I'm just double checking. Oof. What the hell did I miss? Ooh, a bandage. 
Shit's about to go down down here. As you as you can see. <laughs> As you can see, something fishy's going on. What could cause rap? They like, and, and between levels, you can buy power ups, and if I remember correctly, they're cheap as shit. Like this game is incredibly unbalanced with like character stats and like you know costs and pretty all of it. It's totally fucking unbalanced, but it doesn't matter. well seasoned yeah I gotta find Brandy I think in another level or two or three or four is uh, I want to I want to play as Randy everyone plays as Eriko because she's like by far the best character Okay, the, the mutilated body on the floor, as I find suspicious. All this shit, no, all of this shit is fucking dangerous. Okay, it was the TV. And not the... Not the bodies on the floor. Yeah, I think they're... They, they do have, like, different traits. I think Randy might do more damage in combat or something. Uh, I think Eriko's thing is that she doesn't, like, fall down in combat. Which is actually a pretty big deal because it's a huge pain in the ass when that happens. And I think she has more adrenaline. Oh, God damn it. Which, I mean, I, I, you've seen me run out already. Like, that's, pr that's a pretty big deal. Another Hassie. Uh, let's see. So we came in through there. Ah, another sight one. I am confident that one of these three is it. Okay, it's not this. Oh! Oh, that's cool. I ah, the BPM counter. Well, I'll leave it to you. Does this sound like Italo house music? Show me how, show me now. Does it sound like half as fast as the hit song? 250 BPM by Kiriyama Oka. Errol Magazine, or Errol A, or I don't know how you pronounce it, but it is... Adult Magazine slightly increases pulse. If your pulse is too low, you just, you know, stir your loins with the magazine, and then, then you're good to go. French guys hit hard. They don't 
fucking stutter at all. God. Okay, that fight was not worth it. Cool. Okay, I'm fucking bleeding everywhere. <laughs> Nothing some bandages and a a bandage and a steak dinner can't fix. You have 69 hit points. Let's chug some hassy. There's still... Oh, nice. I just tagged it! Cool. Oh, it did, okay, it counted, but we got to see it anyways. Very thoughtful. So anyways... Bio body. This is all like upgrades that you can make. You can once we can go back out to the overworld and get surgery. I would love for my bleeding to stop. Oh, ER discount ticket. So we can get discount surgery. I do like kung fu moves. Hey, See, they do like fucking spinning back kicks and shit. They don't give a fuck. I feel like the game like rubber banded into being easier. I feel like I've gotten a lot less jumps than I usually get. Did I? Let me take a look. I don't think it matters. If it's further than that, then I don't care. Suffer the consequences. Oh yeah, the six does, does the sixth sense do combat? I think I remember something about that. Oh look, they just have a hospital operating room down here. Can't revive anyone. You can recover. Sure. This will work. I have three grand. I don't actually think I need any of that. Upgrading. Nah. I'm gonna save it all for Randy. I 
boy Jimmy, only Jimmy Stadium. Jimmy Baseball Hero. Victory Jimmy Boy. Heavy Cun... What? What does that even say? Fires. This is a, the baseball. Baseball team was the fires, of course. Diary 3. Give me back my Jimmy. Bastards. Bastards. Can you put things places? I don't know how that works. Just like that, I guess. That's probably the wrong spot. No, then maybe that was the right spot. Testimonial. It's pretty weird that there's like an entire stadium kind of down here with like this thing and it's pretty wild. It's not the weirdest thing we're gonna see, but Number three, first base, Jimmy! Okay now, here we go! Yeah, screw that. So we actually have to leave from this. Ah, hey, oh, I almost had it. Yeah, so like, screw that, right? He even says he has infinite health on the top. So now we're running for our lives from Mr. Banballo. He's just gonna show up sometimes. This fucking map, holy shit. We need to get here. Benefit to fighting over escaping. Um, you get adrenaline if you kill enemies. Which is kind of important. For, uh... That, like, identification the horror monitor. We're gonna be chased by this guy for a while. There's no... I wish there was a quick map button. There might be. Oh, it's Y. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, he like pukes. Oh, it's so gross! God fucking damn it! Ah! Come over here. No, he, he's gonna keep, like, regenerating in front of us. Fortunately, there's a trick you can do that helps with this level, and also later levels where you're chased, where you can just open and close the map. And, yeah, he won't move as long as... He won't move for, like, a second. So, 
to like, here, I'll show you what I mean. He's standing right there, now he's like, kind of still standing there. Now we're good. Ah, fuck my bleeding. Is this you, Sin Dragon? By the way, I don't think that's Jimmy. I think it's one of our friends from the beginning. Yo, speed ladder. An another artificial plasma. the heart rate. Uh, I can't do that. Sorry, dude. Look at this. Look at this map. This map is ridiculous. Unbelievable. I actually, I love crazy floor layouts. This one's so, like, inorganic and long. So it's not as satisfying. I love a good survival horror map, though. I'm thinking of making, like, a Twitter account. Just tweet out pictures of survival horror maps. Rule of Rose has really cool map design. Alright, whatever, I'll bleed a little, it's fine. What? No, this game's fun. Not band How many bandages do I have? I almost just ate shit there. I have three, that's, yeah, I guess that is a lot. I'm not risking it. This guy's obnoxious. See, <laughs> he just teleports like a lot. Got his ass. <laughs> hmm. What could this mean? <laughs> gone. 
Oh wait, I shouldn't be using these. Kevin! Kevin, are you alright? Oh, uh, what the... Erico! Oh, this is the worst place to be right now. Let's get out of here! Woohoo, yeah! You're our savior. I'll help you any way I can, you hear me? You're crazy. Rescued. You can just not rescue people if you want. The reason I wasn't supposed to use those other items it doesn't really matter because items are cheap. Next one's not this one. This one's important. This is probably the most important one. I think Amazon recovers everything, and the money you get at the end depends on your hit points and like your heart rate and all that. So it's very important to keep this until the end. Total recovery drug. Oh wait, there's more to it though, so I guess healing is a good idea. I forgot about this part. I hated this part the first time I played this game until I realized how it's very easy to break. Dude, this shit is so sick. I will not hear otherwise. This is so wild. So if you dodge, you're invincible while you dodge, so you just gotta spam that. It's the gist of it. Even if he slams you, like, directly, doesn't even matter. Ow. So you could just spam it. Also helpful. See, no problem. See, I didn't know that the first time I played this. So this part was hard as hell. Don't turn around. might have gotten stuck back there. I don't think it was supposed to be that far back. Oh, did I make it to the exit? So this is the way out, but we're not done yet. Shit. I can't fucking heal in this part. Alright, I'm coming back.
probably just like st restart from that one part. Prize money will be contributed to Michael Rounds release funds. <laughs> kind of a creepy loading screen, or a uh, game over screen. Oh, yeah, we do the fight? Fuck. Okay. We already saw this, we already saw this. I'm gonna heal. I don't know why that counted as four separate cutscenes, but okay. Much stuff. healing items. I, I'm, I'm good with where I'm at. Ah, oh, damn it, maybe not. <laughs> That's so much bleeding. I was fucking dodging, god damn it. Nah, don't worry, you're not like, egregious yet. You can always become egregious, I don't think you will. Okay, I, I'll admit that this this is mostly just me being greedy. I pressed A, <laughs> you piece of shit. Kind of just have to run with it, huh? Oh, I forgot. Your bleeding's like, if it's high like that, then it's just in, it's fucking okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah 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 words. Doing that, like, trying to blast through it and dying for it thing. I'm too impatient for this shit. I remember Punchy had, like, a speedrunning phase for this game and it just looked like torture. Like, speedrunning this game just seems so fucking miserable. Love this game casually, but oh my god. Bullshit. Clearly I haven't figured this fight out yet.
Dude, that has so much rage! So that, uh, that. That's all I can heal. I can't use the Amazon. It's forbidden. There's nothing in this room. Okay, I'm gonna play it safe. Buy a health item? Or was that like a response to, <laughs> to something else that I totally missed? Missed the timing on? Control room. Can you hear me? This is Control uh, Operator I gotcha. Jackson. I repeat, this is Control Operator Jackson in the control room. Our oil pressure is normal here. Average electric current is 52,000 volts. Generating capacity of 2,700,000 watts. 104, main control room here. Checking the database now. Hold on a second. The pressure on the leg is a bit too high. I bet it's the right leg. Last time I checked, it was a bit rusty. That's all right. It's still within control parameters. And what are you planning to do for dinner tonight? I'm starving. I think I'll have fish or something. At this point, meat doesn't sound too appetizing. <laughs> yeah, we've got enough meat laying around over here to feed an army of rats. Help! Help! Stop right there. This area is restricted to authorized personnel only. Please! I can't fight that horrid beast myself! I know. Isn't that cool? We spent five million dollars to build this enormous thing we call Banball. It's super alloy skeletons controlled with advanced hydraulics with custom bearings and joints. You're looking at two meters of thick titanium for every bone. All computer controlled by me. <laughs> How'd you like that big sucker, eh? <laughs> and yes, no, no way that's only five million dollars. The firers. I love how they even like cue you in by like putting you in combat mode. He doesn't mind. It's cool. ID card. There's something else in here. A salad. That's it, right? Yeah, Salad. That guy won't bug us anymore. Yeah, 
Yeah, I killed a man, stole his lunch, his ID card. This part's supposed to teach you about platforming in preparation for the second part. Small firemen also. Yeah, they're all. They're both robots. Everyone involved is robots. Speaking of salad, I think I'm gonna do food break after this episode. I guess I'm gonna eat. That's right, a salad. You a robot? I am not a robot. I could. I might be a robot. Do you mean Eriko, the person in the game, or do you mean me in real life? So there's the goal. This is what the... Now it's time for... Amazon. You lose it between rounds even if you don't use it. Congratulations! Yeah. Fucking Daytona S. Clear. Is there actually a way to deal with the big boss instead of repeating the <laughs> abusing dodge? It's not, not really. Oh, I got docked money for not having enough traps cleared. See all those other okays though? Those are. That's what the Amazon was for. That's a lot of money. And it just dumps us back in here. We can go buy stuff. Let's go to Bloody Mary's. Drugstore. Cashier. Hello. Look at all this cool stuff. Water. Active. Diet. DHA, Super Diet, Vitamin Power, Super Gum something. Did they confiscate my salad? I kind of needed that. I thought you kept items. Ah, oh, fuck, that sucks. At least you can buy stuff for the next place, and they're cheap as hell. I mean, okay, like, the salads and shit are expensive, but, like, the... Wagulin's super good. Even a shit ton of bandages would be nice. But it's only for the next level, so it can't... If you know what's coming up ahead, like, next is the worm level, and... I'm not 100% sure what's important there. I know we don't use the horror monitor. So we don't need any adrenaline stuff. I think pulse might be helpful. Orange is only thirty dollars. I guess we could buy one. There's some paranoid. Okay, we'll do that. Dummy man's. I think that's just save. Friendly aftercare. Hello. Oh, you can revive. And then photo studio is what, just saving? Yeah, it's... I forget what conditions lead to your heart rate being super low. I know something... There's something that can make that happen. I don't think it ever worked for me, like, 
naturally. Like, I never needed it. Hospitals over there, and that's for upgrades, but I'm not gonna touch that until we have Randy. These stick with me, right? Yeah, perfect. So we're gonna do the Revenge of Queen Worm uh, in a moment. I'm gonna do food. To cheese, you can research that while I'm away and tell us when we're when I come back.
All right, shall we? Starring David Rodriguez with Rachel Devil Monkey and Michael Waters. I never forget you, Rachel. The Revenge of Queen Worm. A Michael Reynolds film. Starring us. An RV campsite has been turned into a morbid morgue, covered in blood and the remains of numerous unidentified bodies. It's hard to believe that such a brutal massacre could have happened in this day and age, especially at such a secure location. It only took the rescue crew 20 minutes to respond to the emergency call, but by the time they arrived, it was too late. There were no survivors, and consequently no witnesses. So the mystery remains. Who or what could have done this? It seems too massive and malicious for a single human to have done it. Or several, for that matter. There were dark forces at work here, and no one's talking about it. It happened four days ago, and the place has been dead quiet ever since. I am okay. I've been better, but I'm not bad. Also, I don't remember, because I don't remember, like, anything ever. It's, it's too dangerous to enter along the campsite's close. Birds. We get to go... Worm hunting. Half an hour, fuck. Blur traps is zero, that one's a freebie. Blah blah blah. Okay. Yeah, I I I wouldn't I wouldn't worry about it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It was Killer Man. Killer Man is Killer Man. Half an hour, there's no fucking way that's gonna happen. Clear traps is zero, that one's a freebie because there's no... I don't think there are actually traps. Uncontrollable drop in worm prices, it hit another record low today. Oh yeah, this is where it gets weird. <laughs> right at the beginning. Worms drew attention as a protein-rich alternative to meat. Prices remain low at $16 a kilo. When the price declined to $2 today, the market was at its lowest. The economists point out the similarity with the tulip bubble in Holland in the 1630s. Investors and farmers are left with serious loses. David Rodriguez, 68, became the king of the worms by producing 10 times more worms than average with the help of his queen worm. I am just speechless. It is extremely hard to keep worms. I no longer can afford to feed Rachel. Tell me if you have a better idea other than committing suicide. Prices are expected to decline further. This shit is fucking wild. Yeah, I don't I don't understand the economics of how this situation arose. Like how worms became popular and just, like sixteen dollars a kilo, like So it's like, why why did it become popular? And like, why was it so... Like, that's expensive, right? Like, that's valuable, I guess. It's just fucking bonkers. Item sensor, that's the good shit. Go on the map where items are. Wonderful. I know she had a mini map, but this will do. We get out of here. Items way over there. So items random? I don't think so. Maybe they are. I actually have no idea. Or monitor. No, my horror monitor. Give it back. 
Mon Killer stole the. <laughs> I forgot, I didn't realize he had a name. Yeah, no horror monitor for us. But that's okay, because there's no traps here. such a mood. You'd imagine having x-ray glasses. I bet you're thinking to yourself, that sounds like a problem. And guess what? It is. I forgot how to deal with it. Oh, there's an item back there. So this is where the danger occurs. We do not want to get jumped by worms. It's hassy. Assy recover. Battle pipe. Fuck yeah, now we can fight. Don't want to fight, but if we have to fight, I have to do it with the metal pipe. Scorpion onion soup. Mummy popcorn. way down there. Well, let's go for the goodies. Yeah, they were not afraid to be extremely goofy with this. Oh my god, that range. Uh-oh. So these guys suck to deal with. They're not as bad as the supermarket ones. Ow. It's very hard to not get hit by them, but also be close enough that you can attack them once they pop out. Ow, fuck. See, like, he got me, so I can't hit him that time. Fucking crazy health. What is this? I really, really appreciate that they just fucking splatter everywhere. Like, it just feels right. That's how it should be. All that for a steak dinner. I think it's worth it. Monkey Park. That's it, just Monkey Park. This 
Once I get Randy, I'm gonna beef him up so much. Guess we gotta go that way. Big area. Look at these maps, they're so big. Oh my god. Forgot how much crap there was before you even get to like the main area. God. Ow, fuckers. How dare you. Why isn't the ladder working? The ladder's stuck. What the fuck is happening? Did I kill him? Like that brings up my adrenaline. But who cares? That doesn't help. Okay, I'm eating steak dinner. Oh no, my heart rate's really high too. Dust box? How does okay, how does that work? Last time the fucking ladder didn't drop at all. It's like the reverse like the slow ladder. So we're going down in the loop de loop. Oh my god, so we gotta hug this wall. Carbon translated to dust box. Uh I remember, I don't know if I ever heard that before. No touchy, no touchy. Get away. It's like tremors. It's unfortunately the closest we'll ever get to a tremors video game. Fuck that. No! Ah, oh, I was so far away. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh my god, I'm getting owned. Alright, see you, York. Your your Rick. Not York. Cowboy was an accident. Who's cowboy? What are you talking about? I would like to bleed less, please. I'm doing it. Go straight across. Ah! Diary. Started my worm business ten months ago. With my success, I am known as the king of worms. If the prices continue to grow, I'll buy a large house for us. Well, then I'll keep raising worms and sell, sell, sell. Rep from Toronto, an outdoor facility supplier, wanted to buy my land today. He said they wanted to build a trendy camping site. I said no to the rep. I'm not going to give up this farm for any price, no matter how much they offer. I will never give up my worm farm. Her prices dropped to record lows. Must be a bad dream. I got 2,000 new baby worms today and more are coming. 
running out of room and I'm running out of money to feed the worms. What will I do if the prices keep falling? Send a contract with Toronto today. I had no choice. The worm market is no good. At least the terms I negotiated were good for Rachel and I. I'll keep the farm, but they will cut some of the forest around it. They also let me join the management of the campsite. I was a talented businessman, and my talent will be used well. Watch me, Rachel, as I set out for a fresh start. It's kind of endearing. Like, he's he's trying to do the right thing. And he's, like, being smart about it. Ugh, the bleeding is so slow. Uh, so let's go to... Da 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 There's something at the end there. I don't think there's an item, though. There's no blinky blink. Shit. You just gonna camp here? Bastard. Oh, it's for saving. Okay, sure. Hi. Yo, I went from 3k to 37k. I'm rich as fuck. Michael Reynolds? Great question. <laughs> I don't even know if they ever explain it. Rachel, how long has it been since we lived like father and daughter? Luck has been on my side since the beginning. You are my lady luck. But now Toronto has cheated me. They never let me join the business. Instead, I work at the 24-hour store as a live-in employee. The contract was a big lie. The farm was cemented immediately. The forest was cut down and the wild monkeys died. Tell me, Rachel, how could this have happened? Rachel, you look well as always, but I am worn out these days. Running the store for 24 hours by myself is tough. My health is decreasing daily. My heart is... I am alright. Or not. I can't breathe. Need help. I think I am dying. I no longer wish to live. I can hardly breathe. I am dying. I don't want to leave you alone, Rachel. I can't hold on anymore. Goodbye, my Rachel. He got worked to death. After this horrible... This hideous capitalist takeover of his innocent worm farm. I wish you could zoom out on this map. Jesus Christ. Fuck, that's a lot of stuff. Patriots like the New England Patriots? I mean, geographically, it was an anti-vax guy. Like, what do you mean geographically? <laughs> Wait, hold there. Okay, there. I think he died of COVID. Ow, fuck. Save me. Shock brace. That's gonna be important for Randy. Okay, I'm gonna use some items because that shit is annoying. And need to calm down. Yeah, that's true. This is this is a timeless a timeless game. See, at least the worms, like, announce themselves. Alright, what do we got? I 
Nitro. Uh, upgrade. Amazon. Amazon's the money maker in this capitalist society. <laughs> There's a joke in there. We were just talking about a capitalistic buyout. Yeah, welcome. We're running from worms. Yeah, I don't know if you can ever buy Amazons, but if you could, and you could take them with you, that'd be like, that'd be so busted. Okay, so straight across. Hug the right wall, I guess. Oh my god, okay. Uh-oh. The cinema theater. This way. Love the scorpion onion soup. What's it say on the right? Happy many something. Excuse me. Oh, I don't want to fight with these guys. Out of my way. Come over here. What is this battle area? It's all fucking diagonal. Ow. to the back. It's great because, like, it's not even, like, the text isn't, like, you know, English or anything. It's not, like, that kind of silly. It's, like, it's just so, like, broken in its own way and just weird. All the fucking onion soup. I think I was getting away from that one. Hey, hurry up! Damn, speed ladder is so quick. Yeah, I I would love to find a better better like way to make the like I want to remove like the the rest of the sounds from that video. That'd be hard. No, onion soup's a thing, but the scorpion onion soup is what what's next level. Too late, too tired. Bad artists. So the exit is actually... I think it's like right next to us. It's really close. I think it's like straight back here. David, you piece of crap. You always made fun of us Drawn employees. Rachel. That Rachel. <laughs> she was always your favorite. Ah. He's got claw fingers. Well, that's the theater. Here's a car. Key's been inserted, but it doesn't move due to lack of gas. Oh, man. Not another drunk. <coughs> Oh, sorry. I can't even stand can't looking at you. Get rule, out baby. of here! Don't ever come back! You hear me? It's dramatic. I just need some gas. See, like, what is this? So yeah, this is the goal. That's how we get out of here. It's titty, but it's covered up. So it's okay. 
Uh-oh. Okay, it's helpful that these guys also hit each other. Maybe I should just be dodging and just let him kill each other. Or do these guys not hit each other? I could have sworn the the other guys did. Honestly, anytime there's multiple enemies is like the worst fight in the game. That shit is obnoxious. Oh, the health system's insane in this game. If you hadn't shown up, God knows what that slimy monkey would have done to me. So you were the one who was calling for help. You received my telepathic message. Oh, that's so cool. From now on, I am with Erico. I feel very strong. Excellent. So, yeah, if you get hit, your heart rate goes up, you bleed more, and you take actual damage. If you bleed too much, then it'll start sapping your HP, and if you run, then it makes you bleed more, so uh, what, your heart rate, if your heart rate's too high for too long, or like just too high ever, then you'll just die instantly. So it's a lot to manage. Items are cheap, and also everywhere, so it's not too big of a deal. Oh, I'm health. Oh, I, I might not have anything for that. Can't use the Amazon yet. Crap. Alright, where are the goods at? None. Yeah, bleeding only goes down if it's before the that arrow. Oh yeah, and fainting adds time to your timer, so you get penalized, like, money-wise at the end. There's so many, like, complicated things going on. Most of which you don't have to pay attention to. Like, the bar at the top doesn't do anything at this level. How much time does it add? Two minutes. I fainted in the last level. You just fall on the ground and just, like, lay there. forget which one I'm supposed to be doing. I think it's behind... out... behind back, like, here. Locked. Fuck. Well, never mind. Well, fine, I'll go die somewhere else. Yeah, guess what we don't want to fight right now? Hey, Teleport us back to the beginning, at least. That's the bottle, let me in. Try hitting it? Not with my fucking health like it is, hell no. 
shit, I need to get back there. Night blood spills from this pipe, which was from a house of mass slaughter. silly platforming section yet because the billboards are still up. Oh, we gotta bust out of the garage in order to to truly make it. Can you use the bottle here? Aha! Wait, that's I was looking for that. It's my dear Rachel's nursing bottle. Oh, how I miss those days. I'd nurse her with this bottle and she'd look up at me. Oh, I guess you're not from the Draught Corporation. Please, come inside. I have something to tell you. Oh, all right. <laughs> They got fudge brownies, they got choco chip cookies. What do you think? Do those look like fudge brownies? They have paper candy, snacky, fruit candy, delicious stick, chocolate cake. Well, there is an item somewhere. Yeah, fucking... Okay. Ooh, iron heart. Ooh, it's... I'm gonna... As soon as I unlock Randy, I'm gonna only use him. So I'm saving all of these upgrades. Hassy. To... Where's the Hassy? I need it. Stuff all the way in the back. Oh, for drink, of course. They've got Sparkle Tomato, Max Power, Super Blue. They've got some 100% Apple, 100% Orange, Apple Coffee. I don't know if I'm sold on Apple Coffee. Such a trauma queen. There's some Is that Soriso? It's fucking hassy. I chug that shit. Oh, alright, let's go. Now I can run normal. Yes. I feel like this guy owes me. Thanks for coming. I'm sorry I yelled at you. Ever since the Drond Corporation cheated me, I've had a hard time trusting anyone. I apologize. By the way, I want to ask you a favor. You seem decent and trustworthy. It's about my beloved Rachel. I wrote the details in my will. It's all right here. Please, read it, will ya? Please? Dave's note.
I'll hang myself from the water tower tonight if you can sell me around the first block of hell. I have good memories of the worm business. There's just one thing on my mind, Rachel. Without me, what will happen to her? She'll surely suffer from hunger, so I'd like to ask you a favor. Kill Rachel so I can be together with Rachel in the next world again. This is the best for us. Now kill her exactly the way I tell you. Burn her with a flamethrower. No other way, okay? This may sound cruel, but you'll see why soon. I really need you to do this favor. I'm asking you. I'm begging you. About the flamethrower, I keep the one I was using for welding... For Sorry, for weeding in a secret place. I don't want... Toronto to find it. I am taking the memo that shows the secret place with me. Find it on my body. Well, I'll go ahead and wait for Rachel around the second corner of hell. David Rocker, you guys. Yes, this game has a very strange, like, recreation of hell, which we will explore more later, especially in the famous Toy Hell chapter. Nice rusty key. There's some more snacky. Some delicious stick. Some leg gas. ELA's chocolate. Some tangy. Also, I know it sounds pretty morbid to go kill Rachel and all, but like this this picture I feel is kind of a dead giveaway like the the twist also I almost missed this I got that outfit Hassy No gas yet Said we would do that guy a favor so let's go do the favor Check it out. Mutant worms, it came from the underground, coming to you. Tom Tommy Hopper film. Ma'am, I am here, alone. Massacre in Nature. Nominated in the National Award 12 section. Goblin Moon. Can't read the rest. Cannibal Fantasy. Do you like, don't you wish these were real? Flash Heat. Flash, 4528 cars died, 35 stuntmans, 200, oh god, so that's 25 million dollars waste. How <laughs> do you turn on 60 FIPS for SH2? Uh, you edit, if you're in Enhanced Edition, you have to edit d3d8.ini. And add, I think it is set FPS limit or something like that. FPS limit equals 30. I cannot easily go into further detail than that as I stream this video game. Fuck. Jesus! I don't remember this. There's strange, sexy women with guns. Can I fight them?
No, it's it's in INI edit you have to do in D3D8.ini. Sorry, I'm getting very distracted. No more bleeding. Uh damn, still nothing for hit points. <laughs> cool. Oh, yeah. Uh, the enhanced people took it out for some reason. I guess because there were still glitches with it, but the glitches are so, like, not common, and not often. Like, it's, it's so worth doing it. Or at least I think so. Except for the final boss. Stupid grab attack. It's your turn to be... Dummy. Godl, uh, <laughs> size is problem. Dummy man. Dummy man. Look down, dummy man. Ugh. Use clipping. Mysterious catastrophe at campsite. All visitors killed. Site expected to close. Bodies of campgoers and destroyed cars found at Camp David in Arizona. So we were in Mer Minnesota, now we're in Arizona. Cause of the incident unknown. Local authorities rule out human intervention due to the scale of the incident. Slow progress by investigators. Camp David was once a worm farm. Toronto acquired land, built Camp David. So they named their camp after him or some shit? That's weird. Camp David opened on the 20th of last month, featuring wild monkeys and a drive-in theater. Size is problem. Dummy Man 2, the overdrive. It's time to be dummy again. Attack of the Monster Beast. Sorry, I love all these. It's time to be dummy again. It's just me waking up in the morning. Fuck. No, I, I will pass. Oh, that sucked. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm in trouble, actually. But I can't afford to take the fucking... Oh, I don't want to use my Amazon. Attack of the Monster B coming soon. Are there any items nearby? Well, there's one like behind there. There's a bunch in here. Oh, there's his body. So is that the flamethrower? Because I want to. Massacre in nature. Nominated in the National Award 12 section. What's at the top? Ma'am, I'm here alone. I'm coming over here anyways, there's more stuff. Tommy Man 3 the Returner. What's the top thing to say? Not a, not a mummy, something dummy. Look at the sky. Like, it's swirly. Here we go. It'll be like supplies, right? Diary.
What's up? Hi, everybody. <sighs> Great lock, what have you been doing? Are you, are you still playing Yakuza? I've been lurking. I, I, anytime, like, I love, ah, oh, DMC5. <laughs> I've been, anytime people play Yakuza, I'm like, on that shit. I just love, it's so comfy, in, like, in the background. Thank you very much for the raid, welcome. We're, we're in, we're caught up in some human drama on a worm farm. I bought a worm from a vendor so I could raise worms. The vendor brought me his last worm. That worm was you, Rachel. You were more special than any of the other worms I knew. Rachel is the name I wanted to give my daughter. Now go and have lots of babies. Help me make some money. Why is that only one channel point? Because... I don't know, it's fun. <laughs> Something terrible happened to Rachel today. It was my fault, but I still don't know what happened. I was playing with her under the tree as usual. And somehow she slipped from my hands and fell into a gas tank. I picked her up right away. I thought she would die after being soaked in so much gas. I was terrified. Strangely, she started sucking the gas off of her body. She never did weaken. How bizarre that my little girl did such a thing. All I can do now is look after her. Oh yeah, good night, dude. Thanks for hanging out. For, for popping in. I see, oh yeah, that's the other thing. There's a zero cooldown on the slap, too. Until until said otherwise. It seems Rachel is growing too fast since the gasoline accident. All I can do is feed her as much gasoline as she desires. She gets bigger and bigger each day and she doesn't look like a worm anymore. It's okay to get big, but her size is beginning to scare me. She is in good shape though. I'm getting worried about her. She outgrew me in ten days. Her reproduction rate is ten times higher than any other worm. Her babies are of high quality and they sell well. So basically, this game takes place in a weird future where worms have repla have become like the primary meat, I guess, somehow. So there's a worm market, and this guy got into worm farming, but then the prices fell, so he had to sell his farm. And the people were assholes, and were dicks, and tore down his farm when he ran out of money, even though they said they would, like, you know, respect it. So he's taking his revenge. Well, actually, he died, but he's gonna... He killed a lot of people. Rachel? That's supposed to be the reveal. Rachel, that giant worm is... Rachel? Surprise. Yeah, so this Rachel's not his daughter, it's the name of a giant worm that we've been fighting. Sorry, I'm looking for health items. Not like that. Also not like that, what is that for? Is that it? Something outside. Oh yeah, he killed himself, so he's in hell, and he wants us to kill the worm so that she goes to hell too and they can be together. Which is like a normal thing that happens in this universe, it turns out. Flamethrower, okay. That's... None of this is like what I'm really looking for. Aw, oh, damn it. Yeah, I don't know how that's gonna work out. I can't do this fight. Without, like, getting hit once. I don't think it's gonna happen. <laughs> Dave's memo. I buried it in the ground in front of the movie billboard. You can see the sign through the work hut window. That's 
what I get for not buying healing items before coming in here. I was gonna be fine, and then it wasn't fine. I implore you to reconsider. If I get back to that save point, which is oh my god, where is it? Is it really way back through here? So I know you're you're supposed to like destroy these or like push them forward. I forget how to do that. Nobody returns. House of the Lightning. You're fucking right, I forgot I picked up that wrench. Shit. <laughs> uh oh. Quick ladder, quick ladder, quick ladder, quick, quick, quick. I save. I don't think I can heal from the save point. Like, given how annoying the movement has become, I'm tempted to just, like, take the death and just start over. Was that maybe it wasn't back here? Yeah, that's a save point. That is incredibly fucking far backwards. Yeah, I don't think there's surgery in here. Like, I don't even know if it's worth attempting. Should I try it? Like, should I keep playing, or should I just, like, restart? Because I don't know about this boss fight, and if I get hit once ever, then I have to restart the whole thing. I don't know what to do, guys. I'm not using my fucking Amazon. Shit. Where are we? Oh yeah, that's not one of the ones. Yeah, I should just take the Amazon. Yeah, 
thinking about it. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. I don't do this one? Really? I guess there's like enough... Three eight is a mediocre game. Well, someone's coming in hot. RE8 just like fucking slap you and call you a bitch or something? I'm doing it, I'm doing the fucking Amazon. I can't I can't stand walking like this anymore. Finished underwhelming. I don't think it was anything like legendary. Like, it's not a game that anyone talks about anymore, even. It's just, it was okay. It was pretty good. It was alright. It was, you know. It wasn't a bad Resident Evil. this part. This is like the... No fucking way. Ah, uh, really? Hey, it's fucking torture. Now I gotta start over. <laughs> fucking A. Yeah, this game is the good shit. Anyone who says otherwise is just fucking lying. This game had an HD remake. I would shit. It's incredible, like, how hard this game swung for the fences. I was just absolutely not afraid to be weird. Which isn't something you see much in, I'd say, horror games, let alone games in general anymore. Blue Stinger Ill Bleed? I have no idea. Yeah, the guy who directed them had died like a shortly after I think like he died like really young aha I did have to do this one but it didn't give me a prompt oh I was trying to do that one oh I'm dumb I fucked up oh yeah it was super unfortunate these games really were, like, really unique. I don't know if it gives me the creeps, but, like, it's just so... It's, like, probably the most, like, B-movie horror game, like, ever. Even more so than Deadly Premonition. Yeah, I guess it feels kind of like the Evil Dead, where it's like, there's a lot of like actual horrific elements to it, but then there's like weird moments of kind of like zany, goofy stuff. Sanic, oh my god, I can't wait for that. There's definitely chapters of this that are better than others. 
like the wood puppet chapter I'm not as into. Goofy stuff makes it creepier, yeah. Fucking sexy doll. Sexy doll. No. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, I shit my pants. I was so scared. I thought I missed that jump. I love that we've just become Jimmy's dad. Why did they give the worm foreskin? I'll never understand. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Bizarre that it's only the music and there's like no sound effects otherwise. Oh, ow. Fucking camping now that she knows her goose is cooked. Got like one HP left. What is this? Yeah, get out of here. to be okay. Oh, that's a relief. At last, we can be together forever. Let's go back to hell. Hey, you, young one. Thank you. I'll never forget your kindness. Yeah, so like when I mentioned that this game has like a different perspective on hell, <laughs> yeah, it's fantastic. I'm gonna get my bleeding down. Yeah, like this. <laughs> it's very, it's incredibly hokey and weird, and I don't know. It's just, it's a lot of fun. My 
I said, it really does, like, swing for the fences and just go fucking... It's not afraid to be bizarre. Yeah, that's... Yeah, I, no, I, I, I agree with that. There's there's too much, like, especially in the horror genre, like, there's too much try-harding. Gas King. All right, let's, let, me, let me do it. Oh, it's still good on hit points and everything. Yeah, I, I guess it's that, like... Even if the, the raw quality of certain things, like, the, you know, the movement, it's not stellar. The, the sound design is not stellar. But, like, even just looking at this, look at all this weird shit. Dummy Man's World Photograph. You got Bloody Mary's Variety Drugstore. Look how, like, colorful and crazy everything is. I have $111,000. I need some fucking salads. I buy a lot of salads, screw it. See, it's 911. I can I can do one more level. I don't think I can get to sleep soon even if I tried. I'm gonna leave it here while I take a break to stretch and such. On the nice save music menu. I'll be back shortly.
God, Hellblade's another one I need to replay sometime. I wouldn't... I don't think it's really grounded in that way either, though. I mean, if anything, it's like kind of the opposite, where it's like... Everything's... Not everything, but like it's all kind of happening in your head. Is that if, if you're... It's just that... Like, def definitely play it. Um, I wouldn't be concerned about that, though. Like, there's no... It never really establishes rules of things. And it's not really a spoiler to say, like, oh, things are happening in your head. Like, you're gonna find out, like, pretty fucking quickly. Sorry, when I, when I first played this, it wasn't on... It was not on... Steam yet. I'm gonna add that, and I have no problem... Buying it again when it's on sale, just for the sake of having the Steam version. Alright, saved, right? Still no Randy. Bought a lot of shit. I might have bought way but I might have bought way too much stuff. Six sections? Wood puppets. Hall of resentment. Shock it to me in Child Palace. I don't remember some of these. Is Wood Puppet next? Ah, fuck, okay. Wood pu Puppets. George McLaughlin knew there was more to life than running a sawmill. He loved what he did, but he needed better equipment. He'd make the finest, fastest chainsaw man has ever seen. That chainsaw instantly would tear through wood with a nice, clean cut and would make him the envy of anyone in the lumber business. He knew just the tree to cut to prove the merits of his product. It was 800 years old, huge, gnarly, and tough as nails. He took a picture of himself in front of the tree and then started to saw. Suddenly, a face appeared on the tree and it swallowed him. He was presumed lost in a wilderness or eaten by a bear. No one cared because he was a loner anyway. Yo, that's rough. New workers took over the mill and everything went smoothly until seven years later, when a hundred workers mysteriously disappeared. The relatives of the missing workers soon began receiving wooden boxes. The moment they opened them, a maniacal wooden doll jumped out and chased the terrified families. They used pans, sticks, or hammers to smash the dolls as best they could. Ironically, those wooden dolls spewed blood, and this freaked the people out even more. They called them wood puppets, and hoped they had seen the last of them. <laughs> I love the writing there. It freaked them out even more. I don't remember all of the other levels, but I remember this being one of my less favorite. It's not bad or anything, it's just not as good. Look at all that fucking money. We're missing one character. Uh huh. Uh huh. We need 
the horror monitor back. Oh my god, I just remembered another part of this that fucking sucks. This is the one with that shitty boss fight, isn't it? Oh shit. Gasp! Bitch. Way too much health. Yeah, that's. <laughs> oh, wow. What the fuck? Yeah, it was like, as soon as the hardware got good enough to, like, make 3D games easier. Easier than, like, just the big AAA productions. Like, there was so much weird shit, and now it's like, everything is either made by, like, one single person indie developer, or, like, Millions and millions and millions of dollars, triple A, like there's no in between. <laughs> Alright. Where's the horror monitor? I kinda need that. enough so it doesn't increase. Staff only. Finally, thank God. The fuck? There's the thing here. I'm going in. Dead. I'm going. Where do I go? Yeah, but I'll never walk. Seven coagulants. Fuck it.
I think this game was ahead of its time, and if it, something similar came out today... Oh, I don't want to fucking fight this guy. Dude, he just fucking kung fu kicks me. This man does not give a shit. Oh, that's what the Sixth Sense was. It was a fight, it wasn't an item. Fuck. Where's the entrance? I accidentally stepped in a minute ago. Okay, fine. Oh, here's, here's where it fucking... Yeah, I think that would be the smart thing to do, start looking at the map. Or I could just run around foolishly. Really? None of them. Alright. I've had worse. Ooh. Yeah, I think I remember Hello. from the speedrun. My name is George McLaughlin. I came to this beautiful forest seven years ago as a woodcutter. That's really all I knew how to do. <laughs> yeah, okay. Wood. Gonna cut the tree, gonna cut the tree, and I got to cut the tree, cause I love to cut the tree. Yo ho ho, and I'm out of control, I'm gonna cut the tree. <laughs> right, Kuta. <laughs> They had no fear. Yeah, that seems a little too, I don't know, aggressive. When I first started, when I was trying to show off how the horror monitor worked, I just kept screwing up and I ran out of adrenaline. And like, once you're low on adrenaline, it's so fucking hard to, to come back from that. God, I, I love all these little, like, these little animations. I need, like, fucking Game Shark. Infinite health and infinite everything, so I can just, like, run through all the traps face first, because they're fun as hell.
Dude, what the fuck? There's so many. <laughs> All of them, holy shit. Oh, hell yeah. The jump rope part is so fucking funny. I love that shit. It was so I was I was so mad when I first played it, but like it's 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 so fucking funny the way the motion works. It's like so purposefully like trolls the shit out of you. It's so it's so well done. No, what the fuck? Okay, I'm over here now, come on. Oh god damn it. Dude, I hate these guys. Oh my god. Yeah, we'll do some some nude gameplay sometime. Inbox is Randy. It's addressed to his home. I gotta make sure not to find his brain. I have any heart rate stuff. I just want Brainless Randy because it's funny and I haven't done it before. Okay, I'll figure it out. Build up, recovery. Oh, that's not much. I want to get a discount. This song is cool. Way better than the song they have later. I'm 
You wanna go? I'll fight you. Confirming defrost. Turbo in full gear. Number 106 entering skinning stage. Okay, 106 has been skinned. It's fucking weird, right? Oh, fight time. So what? Thanks, dude. Yeah, see, this is creepy. It's fucking skinned bodies. What the fuck is that face? Body assembly line open. Body assembly line open. Lumber coating angle adjusted. Shoulder width. Definitely just gonna continue with it. It's so like, even if not tomorrow, like whenever I stream next, it'll be more of this. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Ah! Uh, 
<laughs> Two of them, fuck. They're just fucking hit each other a bunch. There he killed it. Whoops, I jumped. Dude, these guys are busted. Look at that shit. What is a key? This is a way forward. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I think it forces you to use it, right? If you find it. So I think I tried this before. I had the same problem. Our back was the save screen. I was just gonna like go look for it instead of resetting the whole thing. I think it's just at the top of the stairs. Here we go. I load. Oh, saves only. Okay. Uh, no memento then. Oh, that's right, there's a... Yeah. Cool. Cool.
What? Oh, he did a fucking quick turnaround. Oh my god, this is way worse of a fight. Five separate cutscenes. Cool. Oh, shit. here without activating this. Spell out wood. W O O D. Three, two, two, one. Do math. Is that what's going on? Three dollars each. Unbelievable. Listen up, my wood cutting slaves. You'd better be careful when you start tossing those humans in here. Easy to slip, and then wham! You'll be a wood puppet too. I don't think you'd like that now. Oops, I slipped. some cool attacks, but I can't do them until I'm in combat mode. At least I still have my whore monitor.
Ah, fuck. Oh, ow. Oh, that was so much bleeding. Jesus, fuck. I see you're Erico Christie, and you're 18 years old. From this point on is a hunting area. There are a lot of woodcutters who'd love to axe you wood puppets into little pieces. If you manage to make it through the hunting area alive, you'll turn back into a human again. Remember, as wood puppets, you can't jump. Here's a list of people taking part in today's adventure. These friends will go to hell and back with you, so stick together. Take the list with you if you want. <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? Get going! The hunting's already begun. Guide for Wood Puppets. If you defeat a woodcutter and reach the goal alive, you'll have a chance to return to human form. Puppets already registered. Richard and Anatasio. I will reach the goal and return to human no matter what. Eleanor Ferenz. I am dying, help me. Randy Fairbanks. Comet. Dosko Takagi. What? No prize for wood puppets. That sucks. It's totally not fair. Oh well, off we go. Sure hope nothing bad happens. music, I remember this. Oh shit, I didn't even fucking see him. I'm gonna kill him though. Oh, I can't dodge. I guess. There's a different input, man. Alright, steak dinner. Your job. That's my bleed. Not bad. Okay, it's kind of bad. I'm just gonna go for it. Did we 
want to go? Oh my god. She is so confusing. I'm ready to fucking mash the map button. Oh, fucking I. Oh, I had it. Alright, what do you got, scumbag? There's just so many of them. I gotta be more careful. Okay, I remember the way. Yeah. Okay, yes. I like the game. I love this game. I played it, I think, two or three times before now. Very cool game for very cool people. This game frustrated you guys. Is it can be very frustrating. Oh, there's a fucking tree here. Dude, Randy's fucking killing it as a wood puppet. I think this is his calling. Yeah, there's like a thing you have to do somewhere. Fuck it, I don't remember. It was an important cutscene, I agree. Okay, I'm gonna... What are you supposed to do here? Because I want to not run around in circles all night. It was, uh... Where are you finding it? Oh, it's like right next to the... Is the solution really like right next to it like that? times. It's fun to replay too. Just of like the weirdness. Like 
there's never been anything like this game. And we keep talking about it, but like, I, I really do wish more horror games just were, I don't know, odd like this. <laughs> you know? Okay, I, I totally don't fucking remember where... All of the FAQs for this game really suck. Um, I think there's parts that are kind of, like, obscure. This right here is being dumb. Or maybe it's just me being dumb. No, I was pressing Y. Oh nice, my bleed isn't even that high. I think the bugs are in the other wooded section that is somewhere nearby. Definitely, like, the horror monitor definitely takes some getting used to, but, like, once you figure it out, it's really cool. It's just such a cool mechanic. Be some up here. Oh my fucking god, this part's so long.
We successfully skipped Randy's brain, though, which is the important part. like it's on one of those like skillets like you get at like a Denny's or something. There's definitely a guy in here somewhere. Cross this way. Yeah, those ones where they like bring out like the still sizzling. That like platter thing. I'm sure Chili's also does. I'm sure like a bunch of like American diner type places do it. God, I haven't been to Denny's since fucking lockdown. I haven't really thought about it in so long. There's so much shit to do. First, I think it's, I think Randy's over here, right? Also, I think that guy's still behind me. Cutscene, cutscene, cutscene. Thank you. <laughs> He's beating the shit out of him. What is this game? Ill bleed. It's badass. I just karate kicked that guy's foot off. Slide kick meta? Yeah, you like spin your shin around. Okay, so we saved Randy. Look at his ID card. We skipped getting his brain, so he doesn't have a brain anymore. That guy's not still here, is he? Is that what that's called? Oh shit. Take a close look. Can I rule, baby? I'll have to pause buffer my way to victory.
Shoto Hurricane Kick. <laughs> Tatsumaki Senpukyaku. Damn, dude. <laughs> if you say so. I think many people can... <laughs> I don't think many people can dislocate their shins like that. Fuck me, I'm almost out of here. Am I still being chased? Oh fuck, I forgot about these parts, there's extra fights. You asshole. Oh, these ones suck because they're close quarters. I'm gonna DPS them. Yeah, look at that shit. Salads are really good. No fucking way. Do these just not show up on the horror monitor? There's like a bunch of reasons why this is like not the the best level. Hell yeah. Okay, I need to calm my heart rate. I cannot calm my heart rate. Shit. Wait, no, it did it anyways. Sick, right? I think there's other attacks, I just don't know how to do them. Huh. I forget what that does. Mary dies in place of you because it'll only be once. Used once. Yeah, like the helicopter arms.
a little extra. Now let's just do it. I'm sure it'll be fine. No problemo. Oh, I'm a little bleedy. Not just in the ill sense. I think we're getting closer to the end of the section anyways. <laughs> Jump. How is there nothing over here? Gaboey. Or what that does too. Root stamina increasing drug made of an Herb which grows in volcanic ash causes side effects. I forget what that one actually does. I remember using it before. I think I distinctly remember it not being worth it. Fuck, is there no safe room before this? Connection, not the oil pump. No, that's not the problem. Sorry, uh, we're having trouble getting the boss character out. Uh, hold on a second, please. Hey, we got another customer waiting here. Hurry up. Try turning on the switch again. Okay, here goes. <laughs> the meta aspect of this is always so fun. Nah, nothing doing. This is gonna be a nightmare. Y you over there, uh, go ahead and jump into it and keep going. I'll try to get it to work from here. Yeah, once I realized that dodging makes you invincible, I remember this becoming so much fucking easier. Oh my god. Getting a little aggressive there, buddy. Like, this guy fucking destroyed me until I realized how busted dodging is. Like, he wouldn't think that dodging makes you invincible the entire time with no startup or cooldown. Oh, my name is George McLaughlin. I can 
Oh, I don't have an Amazon. And then I don't have anything for heart rate. What's the threshold? Where the threshold is, there's no way I'm gonna hit it. Amazon. If it's 250, then that's easy. That's like... Just don't be critical. Erica, calm the fuck down. 70s are a reward? Yeah, no way. Call. Nah. Yeah. Whatever, we'll still get a lot of money. Oh, and the adrenaline? Ah, oh, that sucks. Whatever. It's still $112,000. <laughs> dump you back in here so quick, like, quickly, like, abruptly. Alright, let me see what we're doing next time. First of all... I can't, like, switch to Randy right now, can I? Or can I? Is it Shop Zone next? Oh, I love that level. I think that's my favorite level. Like, okay, it has a really shitty fight in it. And obviously Toy Hunter is probably, like, the best, but I, I fucking love this area. Department store. This place is so fun and I'm very excited for it. But that's gonna be next time.